hear a story about a magic cow. I went up the stairs and were quite an empty. Does the magic cow really does it? Well, let them tell me. The cow does it indeed. All I do believe is the magic a story about a magic cow. I went up the stairs and were quite an empty. Does the magic cow? It was a lovely day, and David was looking forward to going on a hike with his friends. He was looking forward to it. David's friends arrived, and they were ready to go on their hike. So David said goodbye to his mom, and his mom said goodbye to David. And David's mom said, come back here by dinner time, and David said, I will be back here by dinner time. A lovely day for a hike, especially with your friends. It's a lovely day indeed. Let's go on a hike today. We're on a hike right now. We're having a lot of fun. And you can come too, cause you'll see how much fun we will have when we go on our hike. We're going on a hike today. And the sun is shining brightly in the sky. When they were on their hike, they came to a point where there was a band of cattle. They did not know where they were, and they thought they would go into the band of cattle. And they said, yes, yeah, they should go into the band of cattle, is what they decided. Okay, soon they got into the cattle. The entrance to the cattle closed also, so they were stuck in the cattle. They did not know what to do, so they decided they would find a way out. David said, you know how I'm tired of walking. How will we take a break? Sarah said, we got to find a way out here, David. David said, I know. Well, can't we just take a break? Holly said, yeah, let's take a break. David said, do we bring any food? Holly said, I brought food. Peter said, I brought food as well. David said, okay, let's eat it. David and friend Elaine were trying to look for her way out of the room, but David did not feel like it. He didn't feel like it. He knew they were trying to fear her. So he started singing. But the tears will go away. No, the tears will go away. And I feel like we are stuck here forever and more. So I'm trying to be a tough guy and not get upset. But the tears will go away, no, the tears will go away. After David was finished singing, he heard a friend calling, and they said they found a way out of the room. So he got off of the where you were singing and went to where his friends were. David said to Sarah, how did you get this door open? Sarah said, I picked the lock. It wasn't that hard, I just picked it. Dear said, okay, let's go down, maybe there's a way out. Sarah said, yeah, Holly said, yeah, Peter said, yeah, let's go to it. When they came down the stairs, it was really dark, and it was scary, but somehow they knew the way they were going, so they were going to go down that way. Do, 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 do. David said, what is that thing? Sarah said, don't be careful, David, it might hurt you. David said, what are you? The monster said, I am the monster. If you want me to let you out of the cattle, you got to figure out a riddle. David said, okay, what's a riddle? The monster said, what is the smallest room? David said, I think I know this one. It's a mushroom. The monster said, you're absolutely right. 
So close your eyes and you'll be out of the castle. Soon as they opened their eyes, they were outside the castle, and then they noticed something that the castle looked like it was going to disappear. Soon as they knew it, the castle was gone, and they decided that this would be their little secret. They would not tell anyone about the castle because no one would believe them, so they decided they would just go back home. By about what happened all day, they basically made it home before dinner. And David had to say goodbye to his friend, and his friend said goodbye to him. And David had to have dinner with his mom, and dinner was absolutely delicious. In a story about a magic castle, I asked myself this very simple question indeed. Does the magic castle really does it? The lesson tells me the castle does it indeed. All I do believe is the lesson.